Welcome to Everything Currency, the show where we talk about everything currency and mo. And today, I just want to talk about crypto wallets. Um, if you're new getting into crypto, or if you've been into crypto for a while, then you need to be using the right wallets to hold your crypto and to stay safe. Because in cryptocurrency, there's a lot of people who are new to it, and it's it could be a little bit complicated when you first get in, as you may know. And people like to take advantage of that. So I just want anybody who watches my channel to stay safe. Don't get your money jacked because a lot of people get their money taken and it's kind of sad it kind of sucks and um yeah so i just want to say there's a couple different type of wallets that you can get into so there is a paper wallet which is you can print out a piece of paper with a code on it this code is going to hold your crypto as you know cryptocurrency is just little pieces of code that nobody can duplicate and that nobody can take from you and that's what makes it you know usable as a currency so um you can hold your code on different type of wallets so there's a paper wallet which if you want to get um, a paper wallet you can go to i believe it's um walletgenerator.net where it's gonna print you out a, a wallet with a QR code on it that you can scan with your phone. So when you go to Coinbase and you buy your Bitcoin, you say, you know what? Coinbase is FDI insured, but I don't really trust it or I wanna have you know, my digital gold in my vault. Then you can go ahead and send your crypto from Coinbase to this wallet that you printed out for me i had one of these and when i got it i like laminated it twice and i like kept it in case you know i kept it in a fireproof safe and all this stuff so here's a wallet that i just generated this is the one that you can share with people and they that you send money to this is your private key this is how you retrieve your um crypto from your wallet so when you want to send money to your wallet you're going to scan this code right here or you can send this code to somebody and they can send money to it when you want to use your crypto when you want to send it to somebody you need this secret key so this key is the one that everyone is trying to steal from you so never ever give this out never show this to anybody of course i'm not going to use this wallet this is just for uh educational purposes you know what i'm saying but if you send money to this wallet nothing's going to happen to it but um so yeah, that's the first type of wallet is a paper wallet. To me, it's one of the safest ways to hold your crypto. If you have it in like a fire safe container, the only thing that can really happen to it is like it can catch on fire, it can get wet, you know? So paper wallet, probably the safest way if you have a safe, a fireproof safe. The second, you have desktop wallets. So with desktop wallets, there's plenty of them. You know, I looked up, best desktop wallet you got electrum exodus guardia Jax, armory and for me the two desktop wallets that i like i like electrum wallet um it's proven it's been working um as far as i know hasn't had any hacks and then jacks wallet um which i also like you can hold a lot of cryptos on there you can have this wallet right on your phone so you can store basically you can store those codes basically directly on this app on your phone now this is a little bit more risky because as you know phones computers and stuff like that they can get hacked so somebody can actually hack your wallet or hack your phone and steal your private keys and send your crypto to themselves which it happens all the time so be careful with these type of wallets but it is another way if you think your computer is protected you have a vpn you have um all the stuff you have all the stuff you need to protect yourself um, then you can go ahead and use a desktop wallet or a wallet that goes to your phone. So you got Jax and you got Electrum. Go ahead and check those out. And then last but not least is the hardware wallet. Now, a lot of people believe that the hardware wallet is the best way to store your crypto. Um, but at the same time, with the hardware wallet, you still need to back up your private keys and your, your passphrase or, you know, and stuff like that on a piece of paper. So... It's kind of the same thing but for ease of use hardware wallet is the best way to go it's like having your own bank i have one right here i got my ledger nano x and um you know with with the hardware wallet it's kind of the best and easiest way to um to store your coins and the hardware the ledger nano x 
lets you store a lot of cryptos on there and um it's very easy to use got you know one or two buttons on it i think it's one button actually um oh yeah it's two buttons but you know i don't really use it that much because i just hold my crypto on there whenever i get a good amount that i'm not comfortable having on my phone then i go ahead and send it to here and that gets stored forever i could keep that you know put in my safe don't let nobody touch it so with that ledger is a proven company that's been in the crypto space for a minute and they've been providing good stuff so you can go ahead and check out ledger.com don't buy a ledger off of amazon or something like that because people are known to you know give you something fake that they they have the private keys to and when, as soon as you put crypto on there it's like poof it's gone so be careful and then there's this one if you want something a little nicer with a nice screen on it um they have this this titan um this titan one right here go ahead and check out the hardware wallet um they say it's a cold wallet not just a hardware wallet so you have cold wallets and you have hot wallets a hot wallet is anything that could be connected to the internet cold wallet is not connected to the internet and that's the beauty of having a ledger so with that being said pretty soon i'm going to be giving away this ledger nano s that i got for free when i bought this ledger and you know when i get to a certain point i get to a certain amount of subscribers i'm thinking 300 i'm gonna go ahead and give this away so go ahead and like subscribe i haven't opened it straight from the factory um you know go ahead and like subscribe turn on post notifications if you want to win this ledger right here and um let me know what you guys think until next time turn up till next time i already said turn up till next time peace